To turn slacker on, push the power button on the left. Double dashes means you're past the 199 millimeter reading range. To reset it to zero, press the power button. To turn it off, hold the power button for five seconds or it will power off automatically after five minutes. For the rear, place the adhesive loop directly above the rear axle so the slacker cable will be vertical when connected. Center slacker on the axle and hook the cable to the loop. Angle slacker with the cable and turn it on. If you're using the remote display, strap it on the handlebars where it will be easy to see. Connect the remote with the supply cable and tuck it under the seat to keep from snagging it with your boot. The remote will power up and sync with the main unit. For the forks, strap the fork adapter firmly to the upper tube and point it straight out. Center slacker on the axle and connect the hook to the adapter. Angle slacker with the cable and turn it on. To zero slacker out, lift the bike against the side stand to unload the suspension and press the power button to zero it out. For the rear, also lift the bike against the side stand and zero it out. To take measurements, roll the bike next to a wall and balance against it with your elbow. Bounce the bike to settle the suspension and note the reading. For more information and support, please visit motool.co. That's M-O-T-O-O-L dot C-O.